A council has had to apologise to a mother who, while visiting her child's grave, got her legs stuck in mud that covered and surrounded the grave. Poor drainage and heavy rain are being blamed for the mud at Bally Vester Cemetery near Donaghadee. People say they have been complaining for months. Declan Harvey reports. What word would you use to describe this? Can't think of anything other than horrendous. It's just hideous. Bailey was born prematurely and he died when he was 33 days. We came here for his birthday, he was 12 on New Year's Eve. And we came with some balloons and ornaments and things for his grave. And you can see what state we found it in. And the stage where I ended up sinking into the grave, up to my knees. Although shaken and upset, Michelle shared a video of what was happening to her online. She said she was tired of the council ignoring her complaints about drainage. I managed to get my feet out of my shoes and then at that point I was able to get my feet up and out of the grave and my shoes are still buried with my son somewhere. Another woman we spoke to today told us she was hysterical when she came here to find her mother's grave had collapsed, not once but twice in the last year. She told us she came down to the bottom of the graveyard and carried clumps of mud up to the grave to try and rebuild it. Large areas of the graveyard are waterlogged. Today, Ards and North Down Council apologised, admitting there is a problem and a temporary fix will be found until additional drains are installed during the summer. People should be able to come to visit their loved ones here, spend some time with them that perhaps they couldn't have done in the past without having to wear Wellington boots or to be concerned about sinking into mud. Looking at the scale of the problem here, is cost going to be an issue in trying to fix this? It doesn't really matter, to be honest with you. This is such an important place for people in our borough that we need to take this, this work in hand and make sure it's done. Looking at this in the state it's in, what's going through your mind? I just feel completely broken. Um, I just feel like I've let my son down. Declan Harvey, BBC Newsline, near Donaghadee.